Do you want to make your thumbnails like this? I mean, fuck. Do you want to make? Do you want to make your YouTube banners just like this? Make sure to watch this whole entire video, this uh, tutorial, and yeah. And you might be like, Yuzo, what do you mean free when it's Photoshop? So basically, if you join my Discord server, there is um, you like if you send proof of your sub. Um, there will be like uh, you will get access to a channel called Video Stuff, and in that channel, you will be able to get the Photoshop uh 2021, the version I'm using for entirely free. Just click download, and boom, it's gonna download. And once you've done download, yeah, it's just basically for Photoshop. It's real Photoshop as well, it's just a cracked version, but it's still the Photoshop I'm using. So that's that's what I mean by free. All right, so step number one is gonna be click Create New. Once you're in Photoshop, click Create New. And then click, uh, and then uh, on the width to two uh, two five six zero, so two thousand five hundred and sixty, and on the height to four twenty five. So there we go. Yeah, use that, and the resolution should be set to seventy. I don't even know seventy. And yeah, click create, and you're gonna be in this thing. This may not look like a YouTube banner, but trust me, it is. Well, it kind of does look like one, but. Basically, I'm going to show you at the end of the video how to put it into a template and how to like actually put it on your YouTube channel. So that will be at the end of the video. So for this tutorial, I'm actually going to be doing um, a anime um, banner. So yeah. Uh, anyway, so the first things first, you're going to have this, of course. What you're going to do is you're going to select a background color. You're going to select uh, two or more main colors. You want to keep you want to keep like you do not want to have more than three color like main colors you want main colors all right so you want your banners to only have like three colors but um for this tutorial i'm gonna do like two i guess it's gonna be white and pink or white and i'll see to be honest and yeah all right so what you want to do is you want to search up an anime character and what i'm gonna be using for this is kakashi render png that's so you gotta search up now look for a good render that will match this type of you know banner style i'll be choosing this guy right here um hardness let's just remove the watermark of course most of these renders are probably gonna have watermark just erase them simply it's not a big deal so for this tutorial i'm actually gonna be having a white background or uh, you can have black or white actually just do white uh, it's a black and white banner as you saw in the tutorial thingy thumbnail i mean um yeah so just pick two main colors just like that um all right so what you want to do is you want to pick your text or actually first do the background so click a new layer click the polygon lasso tool and just create like a little swish kind of like a just like that that's not good hold on you need like a ramp kind of thing so that it's like a hill if you know what i mean there we go that's good so just do that color it black or just press alt delete and boom there you have something like this you can actually move this just a bit to the side since I feel like it would be better just like this. And I actually just color this as well. All right, so it's gonna look like this, right? That's nice. Pick the render behind this because you always wanna have the render behind. Now actually what you wanna do with the render is you wanna copy the render and you wanna make it bigger. Actually hold Alt while doing it, there you go. And now what you actually wanna do, you wanna move it just a bit to the side just like that you want to put the passy bit down just like that and you want to put it behind the character this looks exactly like this now what you want to do is you want to pick your text tool just like this you want to put the text and just type your name i'm going to be using the akira expanded font i really like that font and you want to put it in the middle like this. And now you're probably going to be like, wait, but I can't see this. And I can't see that. Yep, I know. So what you want to do, you want to color this white. And actually, you want to pick this 
above. Okay, well, that's not going to happen. Go with the magnetic tool thingy. Just go around. I don't know if that's actually how it's supposed to be. So, hold on. Actually, take the... Yep, put the passy bit down. Go to the pull again tool. And just line it out. Like this. And you want to put around like that. Alright, so now if you go to the text, now what you want to do with the text is you, of course, want to color it thingy white. So, how you do that, um, you go to the... <laughs> Dude, I, I kind of forgot how you do this part, but um, if you just cut out the text... Okay, wait. Um, rasterize type. And if you just cut out the text... Just like that. You make a new layer and then hold Alt and you just color this white. You can actually put this to max now. Same goes with this. You put this to max. So you could just go this color white. Just like that. Go to the main text and you actually want to click blending options. And pick the color black here. There we go. Now it should look something like this. So you can see that the hill goes like that, you know, you know what I mean? It just kind of like, you know what I mean? Yeah. So it just blends, you know, anyway, once you've done that, what you want to do now, we can pick, you can put text right there. I'll show you right now how to do that. So you pick a nice, like small little font thing. You put the text a bit smaller and you can type whatever you want. Okay. Make sure it's black text. So you can be like, YouTube. Okay, let's use a different font. Um, this works. So be like, you can put like your subscriber goal. Boom. For me, it's gonna be ten thousand subscribers. You can just put put like small stuff here. Just like that and you can put like your age so you can just copy this go down right here hold shift while going down you can just do like age i don't know i'm 15 so i'm just do 15. you can do like you just you can just copy this boom you can do name oh shit. you can just do like name alex slash user you can just put small stuff like that up here, or it looks cleaner if you do it this way. Hold on. If you just type like a full paragraph, like, I don't know, just type a text here. I don't know. Hey, this is Uzo's. Okay, this is Uzo. Okay, thank Uzo. Uzo. Hey, this is Uzo channel, and he is a pro. Okay, that's a bit. He is a prof professional GFX designer and he also likes to make videos and he make sure to subscribe and like, I don't know, just do some. Um, so you see, it looks like cleaner. You can change the font. This is definitely not the font I can tell. Yeah, hold on. This is definitely not the font. So you want to actually do, oh yeah, add these two right here as well. There you go. But this is definitely not the font. You want to put a good font. All right, so that's going to be like that. I'm just going to leave it like this. All right. Um, once you've done that, you have a lot of space. All right, so actually what I want to do to the background first is actually create another layer to the background. You want to pick the color white and just make, okay, no, put that over there. I just want to like add a bit of like, hold on, like, what do you call it? Like a bit of like this, you know what I mean? Like a bit of like light coming like that. And I want to do the same to this. Oh, 
Oh, okay, hold on. Hold on a minute. <laughs> Alright, so what you actually want to do, yeah, just do this. There you go. It just looks it just looks a bit better, you know. Look. Just kinda adds more like stuff to it. I don't know. I don't know which Alright, so since this is a YouTube banner, a lot of people like adding like um what's it called? Like social media icons and like social media promoting your social media. So just do that real quick. Add it on top of everything. Just like that. And use the magic wand tool to just select that. Alright, so what you wanna do now is you actually wanna Bro, hold on, it's zooming hard, it's kinda hard. Alright, so like that. You wanna click control R if you don't have this thing. You wanna bring out like this, this thing. And you wanna put it right here, around there. On your banner, you want to put this as small as you can, uh, or not as small as you can, but just like that. And you want to keep it like this. So we're gonna add only three icons, three social media icons, since I don't really use more. <laughs> um, yeah, but just place them. By the way, take off the color of them as well. So if this one is. But we'll, we'll do it at the end. I'll show you. So make sure they're like the, around the same size. Like this looks around the same size. This. Yeah, that's around the same size. So we're going to put one there. Nope, that's too low. I'm going to put one in the middle. Twitter can go a bit higher. <sighs> So you can actually add another one. So yeah, I mean Discord. I you can add Instagram as well. Of course, I don't really use. I mean, I do use Instagram, but you know, I don't like to promote it. I don't know. Hey, but do follow my Instagram though, if you know what I mean. Anyway, just add it like that. There you go, just add something like that. Now you want to actually select all of them and click Control E to merge it. You want to pick the color, make sure it's black. Just looks a more cleaner, in my opinion. And what you want to do now is that you want to create a little, a little like line, just like this. Create a new layer. Just create a little line. And duplicate it and add it on every single thing just like that and now what you can do is you add your text add a simple cool looking font which is like simple to read what I mean you know um, for this tutorial I'm gonna be using Probably the future, bro. The Futura or something like that, bro. Hold on. <laughs> I need to, bro. Alright. I'm going to just search. There you go. This one right here. At Twitter. At. You so. Uh, I don't even use Twitter, to be honest. <laughs> I don't know why I'm promoting it. I just like promoting it. So use a simple text like this. You can make it bigger. There we go. And to be honest, use full caps. I think that looks better. Um, yeah, I guess. Yeah, full caps. So it's use OT. And I guess I don't know what I mean by Discord. I'll just do dot gg slash user. There we go. And it looks some like this. Why does this look smaller? Hold on. I think I did something wrong. Bro, all right. Dot G dot G, G slash Uzo. And boom. It will look some like that. That's what like, a lot of people like to do. It looks pretty clean for some people. <laughs> and yeah, just like that. 
and now line up the text with absolutely all of them. There you go. So now once you, bro, what is up with my accent? Anyway, now once you've done that, you're basically done. You can of course, of course, add more stuff, but um, I'm just gonna leave it at here. So let me save it and add it on my channel thing. All right, now everyone knows how to save it. Click file, click save as, click save on your computer, and then here, and then click select PNG. <coughs> We're gonna call it the YouTube banner. And boom, there you go. That's how you save it. All right, so you're gonna go on YouTube, of course. Um, okay, don't mind Social Blade. I just like checking my stuff. Uh, <coughs> here you're gonna have banner image, click change. And I'll select the one you're using. So, of course, we're gonna go here and we're gonna find the one we just made, click. If it says that, what you wanna do is you wanna click on new tab. I, I love image, that's a website you wanna use. Compress image and select image and select the image you just made. Boom. Now what you wanna do is you wanna click compress image. You wanna click back on your channel, click change. Oh, actually, I think you can just, okay, no, that's not gonna work. So you click change, downloads or wherever you're saved. Boom, if it says that, <laughs> what you want to do is you want to go Photoshop, click File, New, and then you want to click with 2560 and then by 1440, you want to click Create. And now what you want to do is you want to click, um, you, you want to search up a YouTube banner template just like that. You're going to have something like this. Click Copy Image, put it in here. And now, of course, you're going to group this, group it, and then press Control J and Control E to merge it. And you just want to put this here and here, and you just want to put it in the middle. Is that the middle? Yeah, it's got to be kept. Um, anyway, what you want to do is you want to select the middle. So you want to just go select like this. There we go. And now what you want to do is you select inverse, you create a new layer and you pick white and just do this. Trust the process, trust the process. And now select inverse, go back to this layer and then delete this. And now open this layer and make sure this layer is behind here and put it in here. There we go. Now this should be good. There you go. Just do that. Click save, save as, boom. PNG, save it wherever your YouTube banner thing was. Click yes, click okay. Now just wait for it to save. And now once you go back, you probably have to do the I love image thing again. This website will be linked in the description if, you, if you're lazy. Okay, so now you want to click I love image, compress image, select images. Back to this one, boom, boom, boom. Now you wanna wait for this to download and everything, download compressed images, click change, click downloads and open your file. Boom, that should, this is good. Um, so, yeah, you might wanna move the text a bit to there to the to the side yeah then click done yep all right once you have done that you want to click publish actually it does not matter since on pc you're gonna be i mean who watches still okay not a lot of people watch on you i mean on mobile anyway look now it looks like this see there is my thumbnail uh, i mean banner i mean yeah banner so i hope you guys did enjoy this video smash a like and subscribe and yeah peace out. I'm sorry. I know this wasn't the best tutorial, but hey, I'm going to try better. Trust me.